Good readings and salutations everyone, Amadeus44 here, and welcome back to another rousing episode of Minecraft. On the uh -huh. Amacraft server, of course. Anyways, uh, to break up the, I guess you can call it monotony, of uh, the building of the farm, I'm going to do a little bit of construction on the house. Yes, that temporary uh, building is not my house. Hence the reason why it's called a temporary building, right? Anyways, I have some plans. And I think I'm going to get back with you uh, once I am a bit uh, further along with my plans. So, see you soon. And night has fallen on my land once more. <clears throat> well... Guess that means I gotta go hunt more Endermen, right? Right. Now the big question arises. Where the crap are they? Seriously. You usually see them everywhere if you're not looking for them. But when you do start looking for them, you don't see them anywhere. And it's, yeah, it's kind of frustrating. Trying to keep my eyes open on the mini-map, while still trying to watch out for these lovelies. Come on, Enderman. Enderman. Ow. You're not an Enderman. Nor are you. You're a spider. Ah, boy. Anyways, have a little bit of dinner, a little bit of dessert, and let's hope to find some more. Also, I got another point of looting on my shovel. Yay. Which means that I'm going to get even more, uh, not gravel. Flint, I mean. Ooh. Somebody did not get this gold gravel. Very nice. Hey zombie, please do not kill me. And a couple more of the gold gravel ore. Very nice, very nice. Uh, hmm. Well, oh wait, wait, I see some endermen. Now, hey, stop it. You're not one of my targets. But you are. And how many nine ender pearls in total? Eh, I guess that's tolerable. I think four of them equals a bucket of molten ender. And each bucket of molten ender gives four endurium? Ooh, some more guys. Hey! Ah, uh, so glad I can one-hit these endermen. <coughs> Anybody else? Please? Uh, and we are now up to a dozen. Very nice. Hmm. Anybody else? It's getting kind of full here. <sighs> okay. Da, da, da. Oh, hey. Hey. Yeah. Looks like there's not going to be a whole lot here, so I think I'm going to uh, stop it here, and when I get back, I'm going to do a bit more work on the uh, uh, flattening of the land. Speaking of which, let me really quickly show you the progress that I made. Uh, let's go over here. You can kind of see it on the mini-map right now. Uh, yeah, I need to fill all the stone in eventually. But yeah, this is pretty good. I'm thinking that's not quite good to go, but getting there, you know? Oop. Hey, nuclear monsters, uh, can I please? Loud. 
Ow. Anyways, be back in a couple. And how are the Chicky Chickies doing? Uh, looks like they are happy and healthy. Or at least as healthy as you can be. For, you know, animals that will soon be in my stomach. Or in somebody else's stomach. Either or. Uh, yeah. Let's go and throw some eggs in here. Good, good. Another trick. Anyways, let me show you what I've got so far. Um. So, as you can see, I used marble. Uh, I decided to use that instead of, uh, other materials, uh, because it just felt right to be of a more whitish color. Uh, the exact marble that I'd be using might differ. Uh, this is just sort of to work on the layout here, and I think I'm kind of satisfied with this. Uh, so, we have an entryway here uh, that goes into the main foyer. Uh, this part will be uh, all open air except for maybe this entryway-ish area. Um, <clears throat> This might be, oh, I don't know, maybe like a little plaza-ish area. Uh, this is going to be sort of a workshop-ish room, maybe with uh, a, uh, what is it again? A uh, tinker's uh, tools area, maybe, so that I can do my upgrades and whatnot. Uh, over here will be sort of a uh, storage area where I'd have some caches full of stuff and maybe some chests. Over here will probably be a sort of lavatory slash uh, XP drain area for uh, my personal experience. And then this area will be the house proper. There's going to probably be a living room, um, bedrooms, kitchen, dining area, etc. 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 Uh, probably going to be two stories, maybe. Hmm. Well, first of all, hey, Anderman, you want to go and uh, have a little bit of a party? <coughs> party on! Excellent. And I got an Anderman head. One of the Hardcore Ender Expansion ones, I believe. Uh, Iguana Tinker Tweaks. Will that give me any research? No. Darn. Well, I was hoping. I was definitely hoping that it would give me a bit of stuff. At least a little something, you know. Anyways, I'm going to go get some more materials uh, ready. Maybe change out the stylings of this exterior. Because I'm not 100% satisfied with it. And I will be back with you shortly, hopefully. So, I just got a rare treasure from killing a uh, rare zombie. See? Warded Skeleton. Using the epic sword. Anyways, I figured that I would show off what this uh, treasure holds on camera. Actually, before I do that, let's drop it and scan it. Just to see what it has. Oh boy, that's nice. Anyways, let's just go back in here and let's see what it holds. Apprentice's Ring of Terra, 30 gold coins, Apprentice's Ring of Ignis, and a couple of Ender Pearls it seems. Yeah, I feel like I got shafted there. Yeah. Not the best in the world. Anyways, I'm gonna go back to building. You guys hold tight for a sec. Ah, the dawn of a new day at my house. Well, the partially built 
husk of my house. And look, I got a new neighbor. A chunkier. I hope he and I will get along just fine. But, yeah. He's a bit on the annoying side, so jury's out. Isn't that right, cows, sheep, uh, pigs falling down perpetually? Uh, balls. Well, at least I can see now exactly how far this, uh, marble goes. Mmm, marble. Uh, yeah. Well, bollocks. At least I'm getting a decent number of eggs right now. Yeah. Anyways, I'll get it fixed, uh, continue building the house, and then I'll get back to you, okay? Alright. Hmm. Yes. Yes. Looks like this might be a bit of a problem. I'm gonna have to figure something out for this. But yeah, it's starting to look like a building. Yay. Um. Hmm. Hopefully, just hopefully, I can uh, figure some of this stuff out in my head. Uh, also, probably should knock in a couple of light holes here just so that uh, we do not have any red areas. There we go. Were there red areas earlier? Yes, there were. So, yeah, these light holes are definitely a good idea. What about, uh, red areas over here? Yes! Boom. Taken care of. Anywhere else? Somewhere? Okay, this one's got a torch, so that's a good thing. Hmm. Yeah, yeah. Starting to look like a place. Uh... I'm still going to fiddle around with some of the design things, but it's looking pretty decent if I do say so myself. Hmm. Yeah. So, what should I do for the rest of the episode? That's a good question. Because my mind is kind of frazzled from doing all of this work. And, yeah. Let's just turn off F7 mode, because we're no longer doing anything with it. Hmm. What to do, what to do, what to do. I guess maybe I can do a little bit of work with the farm. Yeah, let's go and do that. Okay, so I currently have 23 eggs, it seems. Yeah. I think it's time for a good old-fashioned culling. What do you say? I say, sure, why not? Boom. Nice. I get to have protein tonight. Alright, and yeah, let's just leave two. Uh, and then let's throw a bunch of eggs in here. Sorry about that, young hen. That was not my intent. And any more? Can we get any more? Yes, we got one more. So, now we have five chickens. Good. And we have 15 chicken meat. And some hearts and lungs. Yay. I don't like, uh, organ meat when it comes to chicken. So I'm just going to dump that stuff in here. There we go. As for other things that I have done so far, I've uh, kind of uh, dug out this area a little bit more. I've dug the guidelines for where roads will go. This way I can get some hopefully nice farms going. Uh, Actually, let's continue on with that. So, that would be right here. And, as you can see, this shovel just cuts like butter. Also, sorry about the volume. Boom. Alright.
right. And once more. One, two, three, four. And woohoo! Getting things done. There we go. That looks pretty decent. Don't know if I'm going to keep this pond or not. Uh, we do have this pond right next to it, so... I'm going to go and say, fill it in. Yes. Yes. Seems like the best bet, at least. Okay. Looking good so far. Yes, I am trying to pad this episode a little bit. Uh, apologies about that. But, yeah, I'm... The cutting of the videos just takes a little bit of time, you know? And, yeah. While I do want to give you guys the best uh, videos I can give, I do have to, uh kind of uh, balance that with how much time I spend because after all it does affect with my or it does affect my other videos and we don't want that now do we all right then um so let's get a little bit more filler dirt in good good again sorry for the audio levels I just noticed them peeking again. And... Boom. Awesome. Now let's go and grab the sand. And fill that in a like -a so. Just how I tend to do things. Apologies if you prefer it if I do it another way, but I'm my own person. I do things my way. Sorry. Okay, good. And then let's just do some digging. Can you dig it? Oh, I can dig it. Ooh, haste. Exactly what I need with the shovel. Jeez. Okay. And just a little bit more. Not bad, not bad. Uh, 36 dirt left. That's not going to be enough to completely fill this in, but it gets us a little ways. Yeah, I know, there's some coal there. Eh. There's plenty of coal around here. And instead of doing digging, let's just grab it from the cache. I should have... Oh, a decent number. Oop, hungry. Let's just grab a little bit of food. Popped off with some candy. And we have 7,800 dirt. Nice. Let's grab two stacks just in case. And away we go. Okay, so as I mentioned, uh... These uh, areas here are going to be for the uh, plants, and I'm going to try to get one of each kind of plant growing. Sadly, that's uh, going to be not quite as many as I'd hope because of the fact that uh, Pam's Harvest Craft is not in this pack. Oh well, beggars can't be choosers, right? Right. And the sun's going down once more. Okay. We're looking good. Hmm. I wonder, would this look better with dark oak? I don't know. Would definitely give it a more... How do you say? Weathered look? Yeah. <clears throat> That much definitely is true, plus also the dark oak does give a fair bit more than the regular oak, so that would, that would also help out a fair bit. 
Hmm. I'll mull it over and maybe I'll uh, switch it out between recordings if uh, I feel that it would look a bit better. Anyways, uh, let's see here. Everything's looking good. Let's check if I have anything that I can toss. Hmm. Not at this time. Uh, I do have a bunch of ores that I can throw in the smeltery room for the time being. Yeah. Let's just do that real quick, I guess. Excellent. Anyways, uh, how's everybody doing today? Just thought I'd ask. Uh, I'm doing okay. Had a bit of a long day. Tomorrow's going to be a bit longer. And sadly, I am going to be working on Sunday. Yay. But anyways, uh, I think that'll do it for this episode. I think, uh, I've rambled long enough, uh, and hopefully you guys have enjoyed my videos. So, anyways, uh, don't forget to leave a like, comment, whatever, and as usual, this is Amadeus44 signing off, and, uh, I wish you a wonderful day and happy gaming. Farewell.